Hey there, everyone. The Sao Cow playing Peep screaming at Ow Cow while he's playing B two T W. Yeah, I just like if I return here, I'm going to maybe be able to have a shot at saving for real by resetting the scene. So yeah, uh, yesterday. My ignorance with a lot of Super Metroid uh, <laughs> shenanigans have been revealed. Except it's not really like a shocking truth or anything. My general ignorance of the engine of Super Metroid has been well documented already. Uh, oh boy, what's going on here? Alright, so uh, it's a video game. So you got a video game. I mean, I kind of enjoy a whole, uh, like, a uh, whoa. It's like just death plinko where you don't want to plink. Uh, do the different spikes type have different damage? It's not something I can say I've noticed. Oh boy, it's the high boots jump boots. With these, I can jump high and also boot. Finally, the day is secured. It's giving me free health here, which I'm considering to be kind of scary. Check it. We got Yoku block. Got rising lava, except it doesn't really rise. Beautiful song. Whoop. All right, so here you go, like whoosh, whoosh. And then you don't make it, so you're like, oh boy. Oh wait, no wait. There's tiny blue platforms. They hide so well in the wall. Hi there, on the radio. One thing you gotta remember, it's to hold that button to run. Oh. -oh. Then we just go forward in this evil lair. Uh oh, here we got insects that want to cause me trouble. It's like a boss fight. Except, uh, oh wow, no, it is like a boss fight. You got, you got to destroy the bumblebees. All right, I'm gonna do that by setting up fireworks everywhere, and they're going to like, oh geez, what the hell is this? And I'm going like, yeah, that's right. What the hell is this? Indeed. So, I don't know if they get healed, if they get scrolled off screen. I hope not. I don't know. I'm not doing a whole lot of damage. Like, I, I realize this. Oh, wait! One of them is gone. That's good. That means that one of them... Woo! I don't know how I caused that to happen. But it's always magical when it does. Hey, don't run away! I'm trying to blow you up. Like, run away into... Whoa, wow, that is... Oh, I thought it was a very- no, it is. It was a very violent explosion of death. But then, the other one is here now. I don't understand anything about the universe. There we go! See, violence begets violence, which begets me getting out of this room. It's simple physics, man. You gotta study at school to understand what to not do with bombs and what to do when a bug flies around awkwardly. I'm just laying down all the bombs. Like, it's kind of a cool way to attack, and then, like, you know, it's a platformer, so you know enemies are gonna follow you, and then they follow you into your bomb trail, and then they blow up. And the music is like, whoa, donkey! And I'm like, yeah, that's right, I got that door. Did it. I'm the door. Oh, jeez. What happened? All these rocks, the smoke, this ambivalence. I've destroyed the world by accident. Oh, no! Oh jeez, uh, had I known so little was left, I would have finished this yesterday. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Good thing that in my little spaceship I can still go all over the world! I did it. The operation was completed successfully. I did it in only eight seconds. I'm just that great at video games, man. Give me a video game, and I'm gonna be like, you know what? That's right. A little bit of a zero, a little bit of an eight, a little bit of a thumbs up. The words of the sky gotta destroy the universe and everything inside, but politely. <laughs> Background designer. Uh, you know what? Uh, that, that that's weird. Is it background is one word normally? Like I was saying, I mean that's I was gonna say it's an understandable error for like someone for whom the English is a second language. 
But no, like the localization on Nintendo is made by like English-speaking folks, so I don't know. It's just kind of a weird thing. I'm gonna bat that ground. Music of Super Metroid, I feel sometimes gets disrespected by me. It's pretty good. It's just not in the genre. I would go out of my way to listen, but that doesn't reduce its qualities. So if I ever slighted you, music of Super Metroid, this is my formal apology. Mori Yoshikazu. That's a person. They probably, maybe they still exist? I don't know. I don't know what age they were when they worked in Super Metroid. I hope all the best for them and their family. Only them in particular. Uh, so, so this is that. This is the credits of Super Metroid. Uh, I hope that you have fun. Next time on the B video slot, I'm going to be playing just one of them average run and shoot game by an independent studio. It's nothing real. Nothing is that exciting. But I thought a gameplay looked fun. So I'm looking forward to making y'all discover that gem that no one has ever talked about ever in the universe. Hey, Dan Elson, that's a name I recognize from here and there. Hey, Takehiko Hozokawa, that's a name I don't recall reading anywhere. R&D1 staffs, you guys don't get individual notice. Heck yeah! The Game Boy was a great adventure. Mr. Gumpei, rest in peace. And this was my homage to the Game Boy. Dear Force is around. 994 Nintendo is in the past. The future is full of moths. So, time to get effectuous. Oh, geez, that's a pretty quick change. And then Samus literally shot me right in the head. My last vision. Her, her crest, her family crest just kind of seared right in my eyeball. Did I miss item? Did I miss stuff? I mean, it's possible. Or is it just that it's 10% like what's in the game? No, I, there's been far less than 10% of stuff in the game in this hat. See you next mission!